Hi everybody, this is Paul from Ortho Eval Pal. What I want to talk about in this video is the importance of having good knee extension. All right? Now, patient could have had surgery. Maybe they didn't have surgery, just sprained their leg. Can't get that leg very straight, okay? So as long as you've identified that they don't have like a large bucket handle meniscus tear or something like that in there, or they haven't had a meniscus repair, then getting extension back is, is critical, especially like in total knee replacements, ACL patients, um, and anybody who's had knee problems. This is what happens. You invade the knee, you cause an effusion in there. Effusion is swelling inside the capsule. So if I were to take a big syringe, put it into his knee and fill that knee with fluid, it would automatically go into the loose pack position, which is this, okay? The other thing that happens is the quad muscle does not work well when the knee is not in good extension, okay? If you have swelling, that shuts down the quad, quadricep uh, or reflex inhibition. If you can't, if you have pain, it causes the quad to shut down. So then they can't extend very well. So you have this posterior capsular tightness. It happens all the time with patients. They have surgery, and then they get comfortable and put a pillow under there, and they sleep like that all night long. So the back of the capsule becomes nice and tight, and then they start walking with this flexed knee, and they can't straighten it out very well. So regaining extension is super important for a couple reasons. It allows the kneecap to move a little bit better. But more importantly, it allows the quad to fire better when you do a quad set, okay? And you'll see this with patients. You'll gain like two or three degrees of extension and they'll start to fire that quad up much, much better, okay? So, get extension and what I want you to do is I want you to watch some of the videos coming up because we're going to talk about multiple ways to regain extension. Thanks.